Good afternoon. Hope everybody uh, was able to get out of the snow this morning. Uh, you know, those, those decisions are always challenging. Um, trying to do what's what's best for uh, our students and our, our families. And, and obviously, we encourage you guys to make decisions that make the most sense for you because everybody's situation is different uh, with where they live. Um, appreciate the, the emails I've received and feedback I've received. Uh, most of those have been positive uh, on our decision making this year so far. Um, you know, it's been a, it's been a tough couple weeks and it looks like, uh, hopefully we'll get a little bit of a uh, reprieve from the, the cold temperatures, uh, starting next week. And it'll be interesting to see what that does with the snow and the, and the roads. But, uh, just kind of wanted to just quickly just talk about the decision-making process. Um, you know, when we, uh, have to decide on an early out or a late start, I mean, there's, you know, you're making a lot of, uh, judgments on what the weather potentially could be like sometimes. Uh, it's what it already is like at that point in time. And, and obviously, you know, our biggest thing is we're looking at the roads um, and, and what that's going to do for vehicles as well as the, the temperature uh, with wind chill. But there's a lot of uh, input given when we make those decisions. There's a, uh, some guidelines attached in the Bulldog Brief that you can look through. But uh, uh, hopefully, we'll be through this for a few days. And I just want to let you know that, that right now, we're looking at making up four uh, days of school uh, at the end of the year, so tentatively, and this law will have to get approved by the board, uh, but we're looking at May 23rd as being the last day of school and we'd get out early on that day. Um, that's the plan right now. Um, if, you know, there's more days we may add, we may not. It just kind of depends on on how they fall and, and where we end up. So uh, hopefully everybody has a, a good weekend and we start seeing some warmer weather next week and go dogs.